know. Hello, hello, welcome, welcome. We're back, as promised. Hey, hey, feral feline. What We're up? gonna be doing some uh, back to uh, what, what, what croc and boosh. Yeah. Croc crockin croc and boosh. Yeah, or something like Crocs that. And socks. Cro crocember boosh. I don't know what the hell it was called, but anyway, here we are. Whoa, what's going on? I'm here also. Oh yes, Gamebird23, my son Jack, he's with me. Yep. Alright, let's unpause this sucker and... Ah, uh, okay, I got a taskbar that's really kind of annoying and it the, won't go away. The beautiful symphony of people dying and leaving. Uh, let's see. What do we got in my inbox here? Uh, yeah. I don't have an injection room. Yeah, it's called Crockenboosh. The, uh, I don't thing. have pest control. I'm slowly working towards my next three star. LOL. Oh, nice. Well, we're going to see what we can do with old Croc and Boosh here. <laughs> that that whole rant that you went on yet yeah, last stream? What are you treating like like boo boos and, and paper cuts? Because <laughs> apparently you didn't get the. Uh, no death award for two point hospital. Nope. You you didn't get that. So you just went on like a a minute rant about it. Well, what do they expect? I'm playing story mode though. Uh yeah, I want to try that. I just I wanted to kind of. Nope. That lady just kicked the bucket. It what? happens. What do you mean, Dad? What do you mean? What do I mean about what? Kick the bucket. Oh, dead? Has left the land of the living. Uh, need to be. You might want to rearrange things to unblock the root. What root? Huh? Is this guy dead? No, he transformer. Oh, what's he want? What's well, a promotion? You also have a threat from Benjamin Mountain. Where are all these people? I tell you, man. No, no, no death is hard. Hold on. No death is. hard, T O G. No, yeah, hard well, to yeah, I mean, it's, it's a hospital, right? People are gonna die. You cured three out of five patients. Fine, promote everybody. Why not? We're all managers here. Okay, I really gotta get that uh, GP's office thing going. Oh, and maybe hire some more janitors. Because there's puke everywhere. Really? Try not to step in the sick. Oh, the chaos isn't helped by by fact my staff are all in Sonic costumes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, they did that <laughs> Sonic thing. I got a little Sonic statue in a rug. In the break room. It would be like the most cursed hospital visit. Did you walk in and everybody's in Sonic costumes? I'm gonna spend the 90 grand to develop this and make it into a GP building. Oh, all my decor is Sonic stuff too. Nice. <laughs> I don't really have room anywhere for a clown clinic. Shoot five mono beasts. What? I'm sorry. Shoot five mono beasts. Oh yeah, I never. Uh, I didn't really. You're supposed to, I guess. Move around. Trash cans and vending machines. Bins and vending machines and stuff. 
but I don't know. Uh, so we're going to have to put a reception desk in here. Invalid corner location. I unlocked the those via story mode. You might just not have them yet. What's that? That's what you said. I don't know. I never played Sandbox. I think you're talking about the Shoot 5 Monogy thing. I'm not sure. Oh, the Clown Clinic? Yeah. No, I just haven't built one. So I don't have any room for it. And I, I think I just finished the research to unlock it. Oh, no, she's talking about Mono Beast. Oh, the Mono Beast. It's possible you just got unlucky. Well, I haven't really been looking for them. On... <laughs> what you did, you moved the same couple bins around and nothing happened. And we want to make these GP's offices like as tiny as possible. Yeah, as, as small as we can get away with. That should be good. That's all you really need. Yeah. Three by three is all you need. What? What, what did, happened? What did you do? Something was invalid. Desk is invalid. Apparently. Window. Hmm. We're making another one. Yeah. I'm trying to reduce the queue outside the GP's offices. There's a bunch of people lined up waiting at every one of them. I'll make one more. Yeah, you need some doctors to fill them. Then you need some general diagnosis, uh, the diagnostics buildings. Yeah. The patients visiting the <laughs> hospital would help improve our hospital reputation. Sure would. <laughs> but we're not gonna cure every patient. That's just not possible. Yeah, it's just really not possible to do that. Oh no, we lost money. No, why? Because of all this building I'm doing. Yeah, you spent more than you Patient earned. has given up waiting for an injection room and is storming out. This will be bad for our reputation. Not really, I mean, your reputation's still doing pretty good. A actually, it is. It's just really hard. Oh, we're talking about curing every patient in this hospital. Yeah. yeah, you probably have to have a lot of each kind of room and have a lot of people. Is it possible to do multiple floors or are you limited by the amount of space it gives you? Uh, there are challenges to go 90 days with no death. Mm -hmm. Okay, I've got two doctors in. I think I might have a shortage of doctors here. You're limited by what it gives you. 
so there's no like option to build a second floor or anything. General practice. Fosworth fool. Get to work, bud. Ah, sucks. I wish. <clears throat> Excuse me. Goodness. Can I fit anything in there? No. I should have just made that GP's office bigger because or that general diagnostics bigger. Because I can't actually put it. Oh, I can put like A bathroom chairs and. Core. Snack machines and stuff. Mm -hmm. uh, that's a cramp room. <laughs> General diagnostics. No, that's an injection room. A clown clinic? <laughs> yep. I have spent a lot of money. Did, so what did that heart thing mean? Mm -hmm. That thing right, sorry, that thing right there. Uh, it's for general happiness or whatever. I don't know. Why are those ones highlighted like that? They're invalid. They're too close. No one can get into them. No, the heart. No, the heart with a bit of red means their health is really low. Uh oh. <laughs> yes, I can upgrade my Easy Scan machine. Send those people home. What's up? Oh, she said I usually send those people home. Oh yeah, that's probably a good idea. What <laughs> people? The, the people. Ones that are dying. So that they can't die in your hospital and hurt your reputation. Yeah. I'll worry about training in a bit. I gotta. Just... Seems kind of unethical. Go die at home. Don't hurt my reputation. <laughs> Good treatment, Mora. Try not to step in the sick. 
we apologize for the rubbish that you left on our floor. Well, that's a lot of ghosts. Where are those ghost-busting janitors? They're on it. Well, this means a lot of people are dying. Uh, had your hospital been overrun? Had your White hospital... Headedness. Hold on. Has your hospital been run over by many Freddie Mercury's yet? Oh, no, not yet. I've seen that happen, though. Yeah, bring it in. It's a psychology thing. They're so cute. Needs <laughs> <laughs> to be that big. Holy damn! Uh, that's gonna be covering that. I don't know space for it. Space for what? Uh, pens lab. Well, my money's recovered. I just gotta give it some time now for my money to recover. After expanding an entire wing of the hospital? At once? It doesn't come cheap. There's a little Freddie Merton, or there's a little jazzy guys. See? The mock stars? Yeah, the little Freddie Mercury's. Bending machines help too. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I was going to put some over here. Dr. Randy found is very unhappy and threatening to leave. Well, Dr. Randy Pound can go pound sand. They provide food slash drink and money. Where's this Dr. Randy Pound? On the fast track to hell. When I kill him. Alright, what do you want, Pound Star? Ooh, no, don't call him that. Why? He's a dick. A new qualification, huh? Well, what do you. Oh, actually, that would be good. Never mind then. I will. What's that? Oh, just saying, never mind then. <laughs> that will actually be good. Nurse Hugo Thump. Oh, I gotta hire a special trainer though. Where are you training him in? Injection. They're in the hospital for 295 days. That's almost a whole year. Who? Yeah, give or take him 70 days. Who, who, who have been in the hospital for almost a year? A uh, pissed off patient. And they haven't even been in bed. No, they've just been sitting in the lobby for almost a year <laughs> waiting for treatment. <laughs> Nobody would have that level of patience. No, they wouldn't. I'm surprised it took him that long to get angry and storm out. Yeah. What is that guy doing? I mean, as the game has already rubbed in your face several times, well, like, there are many more like, successful hospitals. Like, like that sad face thing. Well, they're sad. Uh. Tired. Huh. 
It is worth putting in entertainment and plants too. We want to keep people happy. What is putting in what? Oh, plants. I started out doing that. And then the janitor just got mad because they couldn't water everything. guy the guy that's talking right now that's the like owner guy so much sonic stuff man a patient is unhappy with the hospital and the storm uh -oh. their top complaints have been waiting too long they were in the hospital for 122 days abominable curse contagious disease has been detected that's the one with the mummies that sneeze okay same I, one as the last couple times I put yep. arc on it bind and vaccinate Fairfield Line says, I put arcade games everywhere. Yeah, that's a good call. <laughs> They're expensive, but they work. Oh, I heard a sneeze. Jack, look for anybody walking with their arms outstretched. Oh, oh hold on. I think I saw one. Where? Uh... Thought I did. Uh, uh, oh, 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 what about that? Is that a mummy? Yeah. Jack, yeah. they'll oh, be walking like this. Oh, here, see? They'll be oh, walking yeah. like this. For coffee, yeah, but, uh, uh, but it keeps people in the hospital to spend more money. Because that's hmm. what running a hospital is all about, right? They don't run themselves. There's another one. Oh, there. How many infected? Seven. Shit. Yes, yes, it is. Says, he dead? She says, yes, yes, it is. Okay, we're down to how many cases? Four active cases? Three. Their top complaints include very bored, ugly environment. They were in the hospital for 310 days. Is that like three years? Like almost three years? Infected, there's two infected. I don't know. I'm concentrating on this plague. Don't worry about what patients are bitching about in a minute. Oh, oh. Where, where? Oh, yeah. here. Oh, no. Does that count? One. Oh, did he die? Yeah. Um, sort of. He goes. Though, to be fair, I do have a cure rate of 90% right now. I don't even want to know what mine is. Probably about 40, if I had to guess. Oh, yay! We eradicated the infectious disease. Woo! The TPCDC didn't even have to step in. <laughs> what do you mean you don't even want to know what yours is? How do you find out your cure rate? Sandbox. He's in sandbox. Hmm. Oh, information. Guard your nose, dude. You just dropped a nasty shit. 
There's some, like, juicy farts going on in the background. What? What's all that green? That's hygiene of the hospital. I think green is good, right? I have to reach a certain cure rate to move up in rank, so it just shows me. Hmm. Overview. Cure rate have to be 100 to get to max. Patience. Oh, here's my cure rate. Uh, what's the rate? Oh, oh, I think it's like right there, up there, somewhere. It's kind of on the, the downfall right now. What is it? I don't know. It's not giving me a number. No, maybe it's just hard to see. No, I need 90, just other things I still need to do. And yes, green is good. <laughs> Policy, cure nice. Diagnosis threshold for treatment, 90%. These are leaderboards. Cure rate. Oh, Ouija, yours is 49%. Your cure rate is 49. <laughs> <laughs> is that good? Close to 50? Is that good? No. It means less than half of the people that come into my hospital walk out. <laughs> <laughs> That's not good. At least I don't think. Okay, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to be right back, and I'm gonna um, I'm gonna start a, a game mode. Okay. No, over half your patients dying is not good. <laughs> <laughs> well, everyone's a critic. Okay, so, but how do I start a new one? Because I got Continue, which is an old save game of mine. Where I have one, two, so three, three stars. Okay, so I'm actually doing pretty good in this save game. I guess I don't necessarily have to start again from the beginning. I guess I could just keep going with... Because, I mean, I think you're starting a new hospital on the same right? Yeah, every, yeah, every time you three-star hospital, you start a new one. Is that the highest rank for a hospital? Highest tier, yeah. So, I mean, it's good, right? <laughs> yeah. Three-star. But... Theoretically, they get harder as you go, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, so... Give me... Uh, just a quick five. And I will be right back. <sighs> Lads and lasses and everything in between. This taskbar is really starting to annoy me. Um, yeah, okay, there we go. 
Back in a few.
Well, Lucas, to answer your question, I am back. We had a, sorry, it was longer than I was anticipating. We had a minor ego waffle crisis. I'm sorry, uh, okay. But crisis averted. Everyone's alive. <laughs> How do I get into this new hospital? Here we go. Mitten University. Gun, The waffles are done, Jack. <laughs> All right. Ooh, this place looks snazzy. Uh, okay. Where is the? Oh, here we go. Here's the plots, okay. and this is our initial plot. Hey. Just gonna have him play. What? Huh? What, what happened? An announcement. Doctor patient confidentiality is not practiced in this hospital. Like, wait, um, what? I'm pretty sure legally it should be. Uh, yeah. Yeah, it has to be. <laughs> I mean, hell, Dr. Phil was taking the court over it. Yes, he was. Among other things, but... I mean, in Dr. Phil's defense, did it really apply since he's not actually a doctor? He just plays one on TV? I mean, he was a doctor for like two years, and then he got his license revoked. And he only had an operating license in one state, which his show wasn't in. I mean, like, Dr. Oz, he's an actual doctor, unfortunately. <laughs> yeah. Thoracic surgeon, I believe. <laughs> Cardiothoracic surgeon, something like that. <clears throat> Excuse me. And the survey is, like, only 40 for something, only 40 something percent of his advice is actually, like, good. 46%, yeah. The rest of it's just BS. Which is not a good statistic to have. Anyway, back to the content. <laughs> <laughs> so, I, sorry I left the call, Lucas. I didn't know what happened to you earlier. You were there and then you were gone. And then I realized streamer mode was enabled, so... Attention, please lower your expectations. Thomasina Turbo! That's a heck of a name. So, so what legally has to be practiced in a hospital? Doctor-patient confidentiality. 
basically anything you tell a doctor, that said doctor cannot reveal it unless the police, unless it has to do with the police and they have a warrant to do so. Yeah. And that has to be practiced. Oh yeah. Any so, doctor would instantly get shit canned. That's why, like, if you have a problem, you tell your doctor, regardless of how embarrassing it may be, because your doctor won't tell anybody. They legally can't. I hate the idea of people lying to their doctor. Dead. It's frustrating when you can recognize both of the illnesses and you know your stupid ass NPCs are misdiagnosing them. I'm sorry? Uh, that's a feral feeling. <coughs> oh. It's frustrating when you can recognize most of the illnesses and you know your stupid ass NPCs <laughs> are misdiagnosing them. <laughs> <laughs> Get it together. Croc and Boosh. That, um, are this you isn't in Croc and Boosh. Oh. All right, this is story mode. What? Where are you? Mitten University. Hmm. Oh, a campus hospital. Uh, yep. Uh, excuse me. I, I'm I'm here like you're in the wrong damn room. <coughs> yeah. You need to be next door. Well, this guy's about to die. Is he about to die? Can you send them home if they have the skull? Apparently not. Oh, there it goes. Is he a ghost? He's dead. Well, he didn't ghost out, so you don't have to hire a ghost-busting janitor yet. Too late, I just did. No. Oh, um, uh, um, no, she's probably answering your question like that. Yeah, no, no you, you can't send them home if they're about to croak. You also can't send low health home if they're in treatment. So you can only send them home before diagnose or before diagnosis and, and after diagnosis before treatment. Yeah. Get ahead of a few things here. Uh, it legally has to be. Oh, if some of our patients are freezing, you could consider buying more radiators. Oh, right, because we're in a cold climate here. Mm hmm. Mm. I forgot about that. God. <laughs> Hey, Dad. Hey, bud. I'm kind of thinking of, like, starting a hospital on Two Point Hospital. It's a fun game. Hot hospital on Two Point Hospital? But at the same time, I'm also not sure about it. Waffles. They were good. James? Um, um, did, um, is the smell of waffles still lingering in the air? I can still smell it. Yeah. Me too. Eggo waffles are good. Yeah. I, I, I prefer Belgian waffles though. But that's my opinion. Oh yeah. I mean, if you can learn to micromanage your staff, it can go really well. <laughs> nah, I just trust these idiots to do what's right. Yeah. It really hasn't been working out for me. 
<laughs> I should probably put some benches out by reception. Oh yeah. Well, idiots is right, <laughs> says <laughs> Furrow. Our docs have exhausted all the forms of diagnosis available for a patient. We need to build other diagnosis rooms. Do we? Do we now? A patient has given up waiting for new diagnosis rooms and is storming out. This will be bad for a reputation. Well, you know, I can only do... I have a diagnosis room, don't I? They want you to build more. What's a pharmacy? The current one has too many people. There's like eight people in this whole hospital. I don't freaking know, dude. Chris Humbug. Oh, I can't. Like a fellow. Jim, can you hear that? Yeah. There's like a car beeping outside. Yeah, someone's car alarm's going off. Oh, <laughs> uh, I need some more radiators. I, I have a Dr. Eggman. <laughs> what? Dr. Uh, Eggman. I have a Dr. Eggman. Dr. Robotnik. <laughs> Technically, his name has always been Eggman in Japan, so... Oh, well... His name is Ted Eggman. So technically, he's Dr. Eggman. <laughs> Although, according to the Sonic developers, Eggman is a nickname. Not actually his name. His name is still Dr. Ivo Robotnik. There you go, people. Be warm and free and happy and... Die! Try not to die. What? Oh shit, no. 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 Okay. Upgrade her easy scan. Yeah. Well, I need a janitor with the mechanic ability. Elvish hogs back will do. Let's see, what else do I need here? Huh. I'd probably use a ward.
things going on in the world? Sick of cheery headlines and positive articles? Then read the Daily Sneer, because good news is bad news. Good news is bad news. Sick of cheering and positive articles? No? Not really, to be honest. Not really tired of them. <laughs> Ooh, great news. Two Point Health Ministry has granted us a research license. Alrighty then. Whoa. I'm sorry, what? Huh? Huh? What happened? Patients are not permitted to sleep in ward beds. We're busy. Recover at home. <laughs> then what the heck is the hospital for? Recover at home. <laughs> then what is the hospital for? I love it. Oh my god. Gotta put the radiator back in there. Make sure it's nice and warm for these folks. Ooh, we lost four thousand dollars. Woo! How many nurses do I have anyway? Okay, well, I'm gonna need another assistant. Uh, probably need another doctor. Just teleported him in to the hospital. Yeah, well, you know what? Without staff, things don't run. Well. Check. Check. Um, check try to do hire. Try to avoid unhygienic. Oh, yeah. Oh, shoot. Did I hire a, a dirty man? Uh, might have to check. Oh, I just added another thing to the list that I can hate Jar Jar for. What, 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 James? Okay, I'll talk about that for streaming. Okay, so all of my doctors are currently in training. That's uh, not good. I didn't think that through. Hire a few more temporaries and fire them once the training's complete. So, 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 did you just fire them? No. What did you do? Uh, at the moment, nothing. I had to bring in a trainer. to make them want more money too. What's up? Cheryl said some have tried oh, to Oh yeah. Greedy money. fuckers. <laughs> yes I'm aware. That's why they're learning right now. Thank you. White bearded man. <laughs> We already know this. Let's 
chromotherapy. Don't have one of those. Do I, I, oh yeah, I have a pharmacy. Oh, hey mom. Oh. We're just rooming right now. Yeah, two point hospital. Oh, what, what did that? What does that mean? What does what mean? Look, um, uh, 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 someone is walking like this. I don't know. Head to the loo, lose your place in the queue. What? That's what that announcement just said. Uh. In other words, if you leave the line to go to the bathroom, back of the line. Is that stupid or no? I mean, I don't think it is. Is it? I don't have all the answers, Jack. Well, I wish I did. You, you can actually change the cue manually. Yeah, you can set it. Uh, Good news, Benton University have awarded us five thousand dollars for the completion of some training. Nice. 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 Here we go. Now we're we're trucking right along. Just need to complete this research project and cure one person in chromotherapy, which I did not build a room for. I'm a, an idiot. Well, I can put it right there. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah like that. What does that mean? We'll just have to move the benches. I don't know. Now you're moving along. Training cords complete. Research. So, so, what is chromotherapy? I would assume therapy for your chromosomes? Uh, <laughs> I think there are specific diseases that, like, make you go funky colors. Yeah, it's, uh... They, they turn people into, like... <laughs> they amusingly named it Grey Anatomy. Because yeah. one of the most yeah. famous medical textbooks is yeah. Grey's Anatomy. Anatomy. Also the name of a used to be sort of popular TV show. I take it you didn't like it too much? Um, it wasn't <coughs> my kettle of fish. <coughs> to be fair, I didn't really watch it. Yeah. But it was... It was a little soap opera y. I preferred House MD. Because House is an asshole and funny? Yeah. Yeah, ER was good. I'm okay. The problem is, if you're like, hey, I want to watch ER, it's kind of a daunting prospect. How many seasons? Yeah, but. I mean, There's like 50 seasons uh, of it. Yeah, but that's if you want to start it fresh, but I remember I remember watching that show when it was coming out. Oh. Right? Like new episodes and stuff? Hold on. Yeah. The NPCs will have no color, so gray and chromotherapy or color therapy makes them normal. Yeah. Oh, chroma as in Colors. Chroma. chromatic. Oh. I get it. I was oh. thinking chromosomes. You, you just got that? Yeah, chromotherapy. Well, it's a hospital. It's a joke hospital in a video game about goofy diseases. 
goofy diseases. Isn't that what they call you, James? Oh. 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 Bird. What? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? What? <laughs> Ooh, yearly rewards. Let's see what we got. Okay. Here we go. Most likely. Oh, day. shit. Oh, I didn't mean to skip it all. All we got was Employer of the Year. But that's okay. It's only our first year. <laughs> Deluxe, <laughs> Deluxe <laughs> Clinic. <laughs> <coughs> We're going to have to spend some money, Sean. Uh, I like watching some Star Wars. Yeah. <coughs> I finished uh, Visions. Huh. Star Wars Visions came out recently. Huh. Nine episodes, all animated by different studios. we we'll have to drop some cash here. <coughs> yeah. So, I need to uh, open a new wing of the hospital. I'm fine, I promise. Hi. Hey, bud. <clears throat> God dang. Uh, as far back as episode two, when Ortiz been torturing C3PO. You know, I have fun streaming with you, buddy. Yeah. I'm 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 gonna get back to my Twitch soon. I was streaming about a month. I've just been taking a break. You know. For those of you that don't know, his stream is Gamerbird23. Follow it. I'm just kidding. You don't have to. What? I said follow it. I'm just kidding. You don't have to. Oh yeah, no, no. Go ahead. Plug your stream, dude. Yep, my Twitch is. Uh, Gamerbird Twitch TV, and uh, I also have I also have a VOD channel on YouTube called Jack McNeil, where I where I upload all my VODs from my Twitch streams. Yeah. There you go. I don't. I'm your dad, dude. I support you and everything. I don't care if you uh, plug your stream on my stream. Yeah. You, you plugged your stream on well, while we were <laughs> well. I was streaming Danganronpa like plenty of times. Yeah, that was a joke. What was it? Oh, oh, my Twitch, a, a game over Twitch TV, and Jack McNeil on is my YouTube where I upload all my vods. What are you what talking about? Because you said what was it? Oh, oh, yeah, Gamerbird Twenty Three. It's my Twitch. <laughs> I, I also have, like, uh, an Instagram and stuff, but for more information about that, your son is my media manager. Because I'm old and I don't understand things. Type it in chat. What? You're, uh, you stuff. Oh, um, from like my Twitch and my YouTube? Yeah, type it out. That's right, Feral Feline. I know your secret identity. I couldn't even get him to manage his own stream. <laughs> <laughs> He's a good guy. He really helped me out a lot. Are then? Is this good? Yep. Oh, it's actually. Oh, don't worry about it. it technically, it's twitch.tv slash gamerbird. Oh. But. Well, that works too, right? Yes, sir. Now. Is that, oh, okay. The chromotherapy research is done. Hey, she said, uh, 
Uh, oh, sorry, him. folks. I gotta uproot these benches. That, uh, so she says, I taught him how. And then I get to go, well, if you want any tips, tricks, tips, tricks, hit me up on Discord. Yeah, no, I, I really appreciate you stopping in. Um, it's, it's, it's good to have a, like a real streamer. <laughs> <laughs> Over 300 followers for Feral Feline, folks. I'm the uh, the hero of 28 people that barely know I exist. She says, LOL. <laughs> it takes time and a lot of networking. Yeah, I'm slowly working on it. Oh, apparently someone's a ghost. I'll get there. I'm, uh, I'm confident that I'll get there eventually. I also stream also almost every day. Yeah, I, I slowed down for a while because... I was doing that, and it, uh... Burns you out. A little bit. But I'm back. Yeah. I just I... needed a little, uh, a little... So, the story oh, about... Pause. Sorry. I'm sorry? I just needed a little break. Yeah. See, the story about my Twitch is that... Um... I'm sorry, just talk about my Twitch. I don't... Talk about whatever you want, Jack. Okay. So... After we were done Danganronpa, I I was going to take, like, a, okay, a 10 a.m. to to Tuesday, Saturday, and 7 p.m. Sunday. Oh, I take days off here and there, too. Yeah. yeah. I'd love to be in one of your Sunday community streams. Uh, check out Gardic Phone. It's, it's really fun if you can get some people that you trust. Kids, stop to tell your story. Yeah, okay, you go ahead. Yeah, okay. So, okay, so about my Twitch is that once you were done Dang and Rampa, like, I was gonna take, like, a couple week break, but next thing I know, I haven't streamed in, like, two months. So I was like, okay, I gotta stream something. And then I, and then I streamed Miss Cat and Mars, which was an interesting game. And then once, and then and then I didn't stream again for a month. So I've been pretty inactive on my Twitch. So that's why I'm hoping to stream again tomorrow. Hmm. Yeah. Mm. Well, like I've told you, buddy. Uh, if if you ever want my help with anything, I'm. You never got a stream and have to be fun for you. It's not a job. Threat? I didn't even see that. What's his problem? He wants a staff training required. Yeah, no kidding. Mm. Uh, Ingress, you should pop by to check out Phasmophobia. Got some people to play it on Sunday. Oh, okay, yeah. I'll, I'd love to check that out. Uh, Sunday. What am I doing Sunday? Ooh, might be in Bayfield on Sunday, but if I'm not, I will definitely check it out. All depends on our couch situation. Yeah. Not not till seven p.m. Okay. Well, I might uh, I might get some of it. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Yeah. 
Yay! I'm a one star hospital. Yay! Tidy McFlighty. Learn. Learn. To a uh, Finn Lemonge. Look. DNA. I believe the phrase you're looking for is a tu finita DNA. A tu finita DNA? Yeah. Sorry, it's, I, it, it, it's rough, I, but yeah. I, I it, it was rough French, but she understood what I meant. Uh, more of what he said was more of just like, you are finished dinner? Yeah. You didn't ask the question, you just stated it. Instead of asking it, you just said, like, you were finished dinner? Well, uh, it's stating it in a questioning tone. Yeah. I'm pretty sure that's its own tense in English. You are finished dinner? Uh, James? Uh, tu joue pour les uh, cinq minutes? You want me to play the game for five minutes? Okay. <laughs> Sorry, folks. My French is rough. I'm working on it. I'll be back in a second. But while I go, uh, here is the... Is Duolingo still screaming at you? The rap styling. James is going to rap for you. No, I will not. Do I not will. expect that because it He's will not happen. He's going to freestyle. Here it, we go. It, it will not happen. <laughs> I, I was going to get my kid to play it, but I'm pretty sure he wouldn't be able to handle it. Yeah, no, I understand that. Jacob is... Um, handle what? Uh, phantasm. Phasmophobia. Yeah, phasmophobia. Jacob's not... Yeah, he's really expressed weird. dismay with horror games in the past. more my thing than his. Hmm. I've... Oh, I like... Pause. Uh, oh, the stream is paused? Oh, oh, no, your thing. The game was paused. Oh. Horror was always more my thing than his. Like horror. Yeah, I like horror. It not my favorite genre though. Is it a genre? Yeah, it's a genre. Well no we can't diagnose that, so I gotta send that poor guy home. Did he say at all what he was planning to do? No, I don't think so. Like, he, he didn't say that he had any expansion plans or anything he wanted done? Oh, uh, hold on, I'll be back. Because right now I'm just kind of... Also, how do I see what's cold and what's what, warm? What, what, what's that? Deluxe Clinic, if you have it. Okay, Deluxe Clinic.
Day, 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 day. Data view. There we go. Data <laughs> view. Where is that? Uh, she yeah. She said data view. Uh. I don't know actually. Ne next to the money tab. The oh, money. so that would be the oh yeah the little eye. Okay, got it. Thank you. Okay, so that's cold. That's all cold. That's not good. You, 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 you can view an overlay of everything there. Okay, that's too hot. I don't want it to be too hot. That should be good, right? Yeah. The area is if it's, yellow, if it's red, it's too hot. But if it's green or yellow, it's fine. Yeah, you don't want blue. Blue, they start freezing. You, you don't want blue or red. Red, it's too hot. Blue, it's too cold. Yellow means the temp yellow and green means the temperatures are fine. What what is yellow supposed to indicate? Like the cold. Yellow is it's getting t it's getting a little bit too hot. I, I meant yellow. Sorry. Yellow means it's starting to get a little warm. And green means it's starting to get a little what? cold. And green means it's good. Oh, okay, so yellow is like the warning. And green is good for both. And then, and what's the indication that it's getting a little cold? I'm pretty sure green indicates other things. As soon as you plop down a radiator, it turns yellow. Okay, so you need a new nurse here. Okay. Yeah, you see yellow is good for heat. Okay. I've noticed that the reception area is a little warm. Yeah. So it is. All right, well, let's try moving this radiator. So let's see, train three out of ten staff. Need to train some more. And cure 50 patients and generate 2,000 research points. So we need to start researching again. Hmm. Uh, let's go with injection. Jemima McGuffin? 
Where's the money in person? I don't want to roll around on this. Earn $200,000 in 90 days. All right. So, uh, Feral Feline, just a quick question. When you open a new property, does every different building need a reception? Sorry, I, I leaned really close to the mic on that. My bad. No, okay, good. I didn't know that. <clears throat> Forget what I said. What? Back to what you were doing, janitor man. Machines. Drink machine and a bench. And a bin. Good. Got some training done. Okay, well, now that we've trained several doctors in psychiatry. I might need some more janitors. How many janitors? I only have two janitors. <coughs> I 
<coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> <clears throat> Clown clinic for treatment, huh? I can't fit that in there. Did we make the two hundred thousand? Yeah, that's good to know. I think I'm going to do another. I'm bathroom, right? Oh yeah, that's right there. Nope, can't fit that either. Um, I'll put another research room here. What? I have so many janitors, why do I keep getting announcements saying that I need to water plants and shit? <coughs> Surely to goodness they can find something to do. <coughs> Excuse me. Don't feed the ghosts. They're dead. Why are some of these assets purple? You might have weird view. Oh, whoa. What did this? Oh. It hasn't been unlocked.
Some items take a, take a different currency you will get from achievements and research. Oh, okay, but see, but like my treadmill, is that just my computer's graphics, or? Oh, does that mean they're available to be upgraded? Oh, here we go. At the awards ceremony. What are we gonna win? Let's see. Oh, I don't know. Maybe never noticed. Oh, uh, rising star to Alice Syrup. Who's that? Oh, that's us. Woo! The floor of the year. Mitten University. Yeah. You. What else did you win? So no deaths. That's not us. Goes to Jumbo Mega Corp. <laughs> Best teaching hospital. No deaths. That's not us. Yeah, oh, that's us. See. This is what your, your first year. Hmm. This is your first or second year. Second year. This is Patient's Choice Awards. Oh, fuck you, Holistics. Yeah, they took it from you again. Most prestigious hospital. It's probably not going to be us. The Orb Foundation. The fucking Orb Foundation. Best Research Hospital. Bungle Meditech. Yeah, they fucking bungled that And we're not going to get Hospital of the Year. Yeah, Bungle Meditech got Hospital of the Year. You only got well, you three. You got three awards. That's not bad. And the only and the other hospitals got two at most. So you got um, Rising Star, Employer of the Year, and uh, Best Teaching Hospital. Oh well. That's right, Rising Star, which means we're not done. Cure right here, man. Our doctor will diagnose a patient with rock bottom because of injection room treatment. Room, but I don't have that research finished yet. That's not good. Oh, there's a, there's a door right there. Train three more. Finish that requirement. Available. What do I want? 
Well, I'm gonna need injection administration, but there's only two trainees available. So diagnostics, it is. Fuck. Gotta call in outside help, which I don't like to do. But I need to train three people, so that's the way the cookie crumbles, as they say. some more doctors. property Thank you. 
Street with my victors. Yeah, I need a doctor that can do research. threatening to migrate into Gaul and so he stopped them and then they went through like one of the one of the territories there that are sort of sort of allies they didn't really belong to uh, Rome at the time but they were sort of allies so we took Go that going through and like burning and stuff so that gave you the excuse like okay I'm gonna go attack those people I don't take right. the territory well I didn't necessarily take the territory at this point but he's going after them because he's trying to find any excuse to you know Get, get himself a triumph. Get himself a triumph because he needs money because he's heavily in debt right now, so. Well, I gotta make sure we got somebody in the chromotherapy room. your movie? Yeah. I think I'm gonna go to bed. <laughs> it's a weekend, man. Go 
going with another deluxe clinic. Gracious, none of my nurses have any training in pharmacy management. That cannot be good. I'm just not going to make it for this challenge.
All right, I shouldn't have done that because I don't like that missing space right there. Oh, all right, well, Mitten University just keep giving me money. Yeah, I know. I'm trying to finish that research. How's that going? Mm -hmm. It is progressing. Small bathroom there, vending machines. Mmm, that's a good idea. Sorry, I, I haven't been talking. That's that is my bad. It's been like a, a no commentary playthrough. Yeah, I'm not I'm not down with no commentary playthroughs. I like to talk. So, so I'm assuming you're against like no commentary like playthroughs of games. What's that? So I'm assuming you're against like no commentary playthroughs of games. Well, I mean, if that's your channel, who am I to judge? I'm just saying that's not my thing personally. pretty good coming up on the end of another year if I could just get that damn injection room research done oh is it done So close.
Don't freeze your dingles off. Hey, bud. Is this research coming? Getting there. Oh yeah, I wish my research would go faster. Yeah, I am considering building one, you jerk. Sweet, I got happiness to 20%. Does she need to be trained in? I definitely wasn't paying attention. Come on now. Rising star goes to Sammy Carrigan. Yes, one of ours. Employer of the year. Minton University. No deaths, again, not us. Best teaching hospital, yeah! Clean it up. Patient's choice. Ah, the Orb Foundation. Most prestigious. Ah, damn Orb Foundation again. Research Hospital? Yeah! And the big one. Fungal Meta Tech? Fuck those guys. Here we are freaking cleaning up at the awards ceremony. Bloody bungle meta douche. Takes home the freaking award. Hey, injection room unlocked. Finally. Caesar having failed, instead moved to battle. His army was composed of 
consist of 6,000 cavalry, 16,000 light infantry, and the rest heavy infantry for a total of around 30 to 40,000 men. Taking Caesar by surprise, Ariovistus marched his force quickly behind Caesar's position and set up camp, cutting off the Romans from their supply lines. I have a feeling after we're done with this series, I'm going to be wanting to play some of the Total War Rome remastered on my gaming channel, which if you haven't seen my gaming channel, there's a link in the description that will take you over there. Right now we're doing a series on Grand Tactician, the Civil War, and one on uh, Crusader Kings 3, but I've been wanting to get back to these Total jokers. War, uh, Total War, maybe Rome's the one we're going to do. For five days, Caesar drew out his army in battle. psychiatry because they got night fever. Man, sit your ass down. Stop dancing. Embarrassing. Okay, so that research is done. Start researching X-ray. Saturday night fever there are many Travoltas. Pardon? Uh, Mitten University. Mini Travolta, yeah, for sure. So I just need some more research points, and I hit two star. Oh, you skipped over the first few? Pardon? She says, oh, you skipped over the first few? First few what? What did I say? Okay. Second star. Two star hospital. Oh, no, no, no. I, I, I didn't skip over them. I did them... Previously, a uh, long time ago, and they're already at three stars, so I just continued on. I'm dead. So, so are you done with Crow Crow Kambush? Yeah. Oh, I need to train more researchers. Uh, my game only shows. So hold on, I'm fairly sure. Odd. My game only shows you have played the one. 
Um, Word. That should you have, should you have played the one. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know where that easy scan is, brother. Scan is he talking about? Uh, history tells us the numbers were for the, this battle. So some sources I've looked at just say a light on the uh, on the Roman side, and heavy uh, on the oh. Swabi side. Uh, but this He's particular number here, this uh, coat, right? says about thirty-five thousand. Uh, is that the coat from the second uh, shelf? Because that's out of seventy thousand now. Using right the video now. we've been watching said they didn't have any. So that was no, because I had to take that one out so that I could put that. One. I got it. I love that I literally have a Dr. Buzzkill. Yeah. Mm hmm. Uh, so if I go. Hang on. I'm just gonna quick save. And then if I go to the map. So if I go to the map, then, so it says that you and my friend Tristanel have played Hogsport. Hogsport says you've played. Uh, it says. Uh, lower bollocks. Fluttering. Those are the three that I did prior to this one. Huh. Very strange. going pretty well. Comes from. You got the Belgian, 
Somebody get your ass over to research. And that wasn't my icon, it was kids, so I don't know. Huh. That's weird. Trying to generate those. I'm so close on research points to getting a two star hospital. A buggy game. I don't know where that stupid easy scan is. She, she said, eh, big buggy game. <laughs> yeah. Oh, well. All right, training course complete, research. Okay, here we go. Got a doctor briefly back in research. Why did they leave? I mean, I think I'm doing pretty good so far. Develop some more buildings. See, I got general. I got GPQs out the Wahoo. <laughs> That's uh seems a little counterintuitive for a hospital, but all right.
Uh, what do they want? Pandora Burp? Okay, you know what I think I'm going to do? I think I'm going to make some marketing. Some marketing rooms to really... Okay. Pretty good. When it's done, I have something to show you. Yes. 
you were here. No. Oh, okay. I thought maybe you were just about to go sit there. And I, I stooped down to pet him and he meowed at me and jumped up on the chair and flopped over. Who the hell is Jemima McGuffin and why is she threatening me? Well, she is grossly underpaid. Anyone else grossly underpaid? No, everybody is satisfied. Train 20 more staff, 4,000 research points, cure 100 patients. Oh shit, I might fail that because I don't know if I have things to cure hair. Oh fuck. I think Pharaoh might be saying some stuff. Sorry? Pharaoh might be saying some stuff. Yeah, well, awesome. Thank you. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to actually wrap this up pretty soon. So, thanks a lot for joining me. I really appreciate it. Hope to see you again. Hope to stream with you sometime. I'm not going to get to three star on this stream because uh, that will frankly just take way too damn long. And it's been two and a half hours. Having a great time with this game. Uh, but I think I'm going to call it here. Um, it's been a blast. Not as you expect to find them. I'll hold that line. Alright. Uh, oh, you know what? Let's wait for the year end. Let's 
It's December 3rd, so... Oh yeah, you're a few days away. You might as well keep going till the end. Yeah. See who gets the awards and things. I'm almost at 400k. I started this with like 50. So how does your hospital star up? By completing the challenges. Oh, so like 20 staff... Research. Oh, okay. Yeah, so I need to cure 100 patients, um, generate 4,000 research points. You're, you have a pretty decently good cure rate. Oh, sorry, I didn't hear him. It's definitely better than uh, Croc and Boosh. Yeah, Croc and Boosh has a cure rate of like 49%. 49? Hang on. See you that? The Sandbox Hospital has a cure rate of 49%. Compared to a Story Mode Hospital, which has a cure rate of about 60. Who's this mysterious man? He's everywhere. Oh, he's Dr. Somebody something. It said at the beginning. Hey, Chris. Uh, rising star to holistics. <laughs> oh, booty. Employer of the year, Mitten University. Four years in a row. Yeah, never won the No Deaths Award. Bungo Meditech. Board Foundation. Oh, come on, really? Let's slack it off. Come on, patience. You know you love us. Oh, they love this... the Arm Foundation more, apparently. You've won Damn. An, you've won Employer of the Year four times. We're taking a hit this year, man. Hospital of the year? Four rewards last year. Hey! Yay! Best research hospital. Hospital of the year? No. Fucking Orb Foundation. They cleaned up this year. Fuck them. Something, something, nitty and gritty. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, I, I, uh, I'm not going to repeat that rant. At any rate, uh, I'm going to save. And we're going to call it here, folks. Special thanks to Feral Feline for dropping in again. Really appreciate that. Um, thanks to James here. Hi. Gamerbird23. He's over there. Who's over there? And... That, that don't look like Two Point County. Uh, no, it doesn't. It looks like... Is it the United Arab Emirates that makes all the weird crap in the, the water with... Yeah, islands? with uh, Dubai, I think. Dubai? Du it's actually pronounced Dubai. Oh, I say Dubai. So yeah, that's how it's pronounced. You, James. At any rate, <laughs> have a good night, folks, and I will see you again in the future.